Hi, I'm Caleb Dennison, and this is DT Daily. Coming up, a bicycle gets a big dose of car tech, roads in the future could be made from solar panels, and an unusual tribute to a beloved rap icon. Many of us are starting to get used to the tons of tech in today's cars. GPS, collision avoidance systems, sensors of every kind, and so on. Now, much of that tech is trickling down to bicycles, and the Valor by Van Hawks is leading the way. The sleek carbon fiber frame city bike may look simple, but it's packed with impressive technologies. Naturally, it works with a smartphone app or a Pebble smartwatch. Head and taillights are built in, as are proximity sensors that vibrate the handlebar to alert you to danger nearby. LEDs in the handlebar provide simple navigation instructions. A generator in the front hub juices up the battery, so there's no need to charge the bike up ever. The Valor has already doubled its Kickstarter goal, and surprisingly, it will only cost about $1,000. That's pretty cheap for a carbon fiber bike. The makers say that's because they're using a new, inexpensive way to make the bikes, which should start to ship this November. Think of all the thousands of miles and billions of square feet covered by roadways, highways, and parking lots. Now, imagine them paved with solar panels. Well, a creative couple in Idaho had that same idea, and now they've completed building a test parking lot that soaks up the sun's power. Each hexagonal cell making up the pavement contains a microprocessor and numerous LEDs that can create lane markers, emergency signage, treat polluted rainwater, route power, and phone lines melt snow and more. That's some pretty revolutionary stuff. So much so that Google has made solar roads part of their Moonshot initiative. Meanwhile, the project is raising money on Indiegogo. Hit the link below for more information. The late Beastie Boy Adam Yauch, better known as MCA, was a devout Buddhist, so it was no surprise to see the solemn arrival of these monks at a celebration of his life on Saturday, also known as MCA Day in Brooklyn. And then this happened. Wow, our calming background music can't do the video's Beastie Boys Boombox soundtrack justice, and we're not totally sure those guys are actually real monks. But hey, who really cares when they can do stuff like that? That's crazy. So, for a bit of fun on your Tuesday, hit the link below for the full experience. And you might want to use some headphones. That's DT Daily for today. We'll see you tomorrow.